Hello, my name is Marcos Colos and I'm from Calgary, Canada. I'm doing this tutorial on how to merge uh, multiple audio files in order to get one single um, audio file from multiple takes. Uh, so we see here that we have one, two, three, four, and five different regions. And I want to make this uh, one single region and one single file. And the way to do that is to merge. Or, uh, as it's uh, named here in Ableton Live, to consolidate. But before I consolidate, I want to make the transition very smooth. And I apologize that I don't, I don't have the ability to play back the sound that I'm using here because of my uh, limitations with my hardware. But what we want to do is I have the, the fades shown here, right, in the, in the track. So I can create a crossfade between these two sections. So I'm just going to zoom in here, create a very slight crossfade like that. And this is going to allow for a smooth transition between the regions so that we don't hear that click sound, that uh, very high frequency click sound that sometimes happens when you have multiple uh, regions or multiple files playing uh, in, a, in a single track. And our instructor demonstrated this very efficiently uh, and with audio which I, I, can't, uh, I can't do right now. So basically right now we just have to select all of the regions that we want to consolidate or merge and we do that by clicking on it on the first one then we click control and we uh, sorry we keep we click shift and we keep clicking on what while holding shift we keep clicking on all the regions that we want to be merged then we right click and we can see here it says consolidate and we go ahead and consolidate that and it's consolidating here and what's happening right now is that our DAW or DAW uh, is creating a new file, a brand new file which is made up of these files here and these are different files and different regions it's, it's a much more organized way of, of keeping track of what we have recorded and to keep what we want and what we need and to discard what we don't want. Okay, and now I'm back. I had to edit that out uh, because this process is uh, a bit tedious and it takes uh, quite a long time depending on the length of your audio file but it's finishing now and as you can see it's giving me a brand new file which is made out of all the files that I had selected before and has a very smooth transition from one region to the other and it's uh, one file and it's gonna sound uh, much much better and it's gonna help me be organized with my takes and know that this is the track that I want to keep and this is the perfect performance that I was looking for as a producer. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed the video and the tutorial and I hope it's useful to you. Have a great day.